is up. Good morning. It's like 8.30 and I've decided to make a new uh, Let's Play Dragon Quest VIII. This is going to be quite a long session. We're coming up to a dungeon. And I just want to get this uh, done today. No, I don't want to make it say like done as in I want to get it out of the way. But um, it is kind of a long dungeon and to be honest I don't remember exactly where to go in it. So this will be kind of a long session. So it will be a long session. I'm not sure how long this video is going to be. Um, but before we go too much further, uh, I want to give a couple of impromptu shout-outs. Uh, while I was sick, uh, you guys are actually pretty supportive of me. Well, yeah, and you actually talked to me a lot. So thank you all to Captain D. McKee, Lister Walkthroughs, Rhinork, and uh, Super Blue Badger. Thank you all for at least you know talking to me. You kind of helped keep my sanity with the, you know, was a part of the few people I also talk to, so, thank you. Okay, enough of that, let's go back to the game, while we run to the Swordsman's Labyrinth. Yes, hint hint, that's what it's called. Yeah, man, I'm getting a lot of random battles right now, what's going on? Oh well. I will not say no to, uh, free, well not free experience, but you know what I mean. Especially in an RPG like this, where it takes uh, hours later on in the game to go up one level. Yes, you guys are so lucky I'm doing all my grinding off camera. Stupid hipster trying to make me dance with him. <sighs> what the hell? I don't get this game at times. Actually, I do. I get it very much. Because I love these type of games, just because they're so fucking crazy. But, as I've probably said many times... I'm pretty crazy in and of but in and of myself. But first we Man, those uh that random battle just nearly kicked my ass. Actually not really, it just took a long time. But yes, we're gonna be heading off to this decrepit looking area that's surrounded by death. And I know I might have pointed this out, but don't go in these type of waters, because you can see the purple bubbling of doom. That's poisonous, and uh, we'll get poisoned, so stay away from those. Oh, you crazy Japanese, and your jiggle physics you have to have and everything. I just noticed uh, the last battle was two witches, and their b boobs jiggled every time someone gets hit, or when they cast a spell, or when they attack, or just anything in general. Whatever. Alright, and this is the Swordsman's Labyrinth, so let's go inside. Oh, man, my nose itches for some reason. Hmm. And that is a huge ass chest. There's the chest. The Venus Tear is supposed to be locked away in that. Must be a real gem. This ain't the first time I've had a bash at this place. I ain't never managed to get as far as the chest, mind. But I ain't doing the off without it this time. We're gonna get that Venus tear. Hell yeah, Yangus. Okay. Uh, where do I go? I know that's the way to actually get into the dungeon. But I can never remember what's on this side. And welcome to uh, where the game gets a little bit more difficult. <laughs> I'm not going to beat around the bush. Uh, these Phantom Fencers are pretty quick. They have some area attack spells, uh, which hurt everyone. That's hence why it's called area. Durr, I'm smart. Um, and they have quite a bit of HP. These Restless Armors... Um, have we... F I don't think we've fought them before. But these guys have pretty good defense as well. They uh, will call in reinforcements, mainly heal slimes, which are no fun. So we just want to kill them as quickly as possible and hope they don't summon anyone. So we'll just let's see. Let's uh, we'll see how this plays out. I hope it goes well. I'm always hesitant in this dungeon because even though I do over level. These places can still kick your ass pretty easily. Oh man. Joe's kind of getting his butt kicked. 
But yes, I am very, very defensive in this type of game. And see, he fucking calls in a heal slime. Don't worry, we're gonna get... We're gonna kill him. Yay, cool, awesome. Yes, I'm very defensive in this game. And whenever I get to the final boss, uh, however long that takes me, <laughs> you'll see what I mean by being very defensive. But I think this is a... No, it's not a chest, it's... It explains something, though. What the hell, cat? What's wrong? My cat just bolted in my room and is like, what? Sorry. Wisdom and strength, huh? Okay. At least you don't need the strength of random battles. Okay, um... Goodie bags... Uh, mildly annoying, just because they can do a few things, but... I, uh... They can, like, stun you... Not stun, uh... Wow, what is it they can do? They can cast blindness, confusion... Or they can just laugh, like that guy did, he used his turn on. They're not that hard. If I remember, they do give out pretty good gold, which... Now I'm just getting to the point of where, uh... I am needing gold, because in the next coming towns, I do need, uh, I will need lots of money. Right, and we don't have the map, hence the BP, because I pressed the square, and I can't spam the map. Sad face. Alright, um, eh, damn it. I hate these guys. No, they're not hard, mind you. They're just really freaking annoying. Oh, yeah. Axis of Evil I got a little while ago because um, I leveled up his uh, Yangus' axe and it, and it attacks a full area, well, group of enemies, which is pretty good for, you know, Yangus because he doesn't have uh, any... He's not a spell user at all. And those uh, blue Lost Souls, they're stronger than... Oh man, what were they called? It was such a long time ago since I recorded that. The um, fire spirits from the waterfall cave, they um, are a bit more powerful though, and I think they can do a few more spells, but they're pretty weak. You don't have to worry about them too much, unless you're just uh, not leveled enough like I am. Which, as I've said like probably 15 times already, just make sure you over level in this game. It is imperative that you do, because you'll get your app. I did not know they could put me to sleep. Well, well I mean, they'll kick your ass, so, uh... Well, we're gonna try and kick their axes... A axes? Asses. Oh, well. You see, I just hate these mummies, because they just have so much HP, and they take so long to kill. They're just really annoying, because you see, they're not doing that much damage to me. But, it's just really freaking annoying. What the hell? Please don't put me to sleep, too. Thank you. No? Good. Damn it. Really? Freaking A. No, well. What the hell? Okay, good. We finally at least killed some of them. Thank you for waking up, Jessica. We're getting bored without you. And I'm, I'm rambling. This is, like, really bad commentary. I'm sorry. What the hell? Why didn't you wake up? Ugh. What am I doing? I don't know. Okay. Um, we are going to take these lost souls out first. Because I said so. Just because I want to kill them and get them off the screen. Because I, I have never known them to do that. What the hell? Wow. Okay, so now we have another reason to get rid of these guys pretty quickly. Please don't do that. Okay, good. I... Phew. Man. I honestly did not know they would sacrifice themselves. I have never seen that happen before. Okay. <laughs> well, I learned something new every time I play this game. Which is why I love it so much. But we should... Okay, I think we'll end it this round. Wow, man, that was a long-ass battle. How the hell long was this? Oh, cool, I wasn't expecting anyone to level up. Alright, 
is he gonna learn it? Zing. Okay, that is a useful spell if it works. Zing restores uh, um, ums. Yes, they restore the party members to health if it works. They re restores fifty percent of their health when it revives them, but it doesn't always work. So you have to pick your battle sometimes with that. And the arrow pointing which way to go. Um. Okay, we don't need health or anything. Why do I go through the menu? I don't know. So, uh, I'm sure you probably noticed last episode, but this is not in... Okay, uh, like I was saying before the battle interrupted me, you may have noticed that this, uh, these last couple of videos haven't been widescreen. Uh, that is because I haven't recorded in widescreen um, since I got back home from college or university or whatever you want to say. In the last uh, few episodes, I've just done trick widescreen, as in I just set the game to record in widescreen, but not my capture card. So I do a weird little like YouTube stretch, which I still get 480p, but is all weird and I don't know, I don't like it, so it uses weird fake widescreen, which looks weird to me, but whatever. We'll go through this door and find more another way down which I don't want to go down I don't think man it's real hindrance when I don't have the map uh, okay that door down there uh, if you can see it I hope you can don't go in that door you want to go down that way but not down that door okay for some reason in that battle Yangus cast mid heal on Yangus who only needed 10 more health to be at full instead of the hero okay um there are some trick doors in this game and some of them suck but this room does not suck because if we break the pots we get a few items but I don't remember what they are Ooh, these are pretty good so far red molds are good which I will explain if I ever freaking record a uh, uh, special explaining the alchemy pot. I will at one point. I'm sorry, I'm bad with that. Right, we got a seed of magic. Who are we gonna give that to? Um, let's give it to Angelo. Why not? And I've been putting it off. I think this chest might be the the map. I hope so. Because I like spamming. No. Oh well. Ah, uh, but. Okay, yeah, sometimes there's actually painting is on the wall, which, even though you can, oh, you can see the wall behind it, so it's all good. What is in here? I think this might be where the map is. I really hope so. I think it is, too. Okay, uh, let's go on the right first. Why? Because I'm right-handed. And we have a Kitty shields, really? Oh no, a can of box? What the? Ah, oh, fuck. <sighs> I hate these things. They're fast. They can drain magic, and they, uh. It's either these or they're stronger versions that know how to, uh, cast death. So. I just want to kill them fast, because I hate these guys. I just hope I can. Good. Phew. What does it have? A pot lid. Pretty useless, in my opinion. Because I am over leveled and over equipped right now. Not over equipped, just well enough equipped. Kitty shields. I think only Angelo and um, Jessica can equip. Yeah. I'll give it to Jessica because she has really freaking low defense. Stupid mage archetypes always being the weakest defense with the lowest HP. <sighs> I'm not used to mages. I don't really like them, in all honesty, but. <laughs> Excuse me. But they uh, are pretty powerful in this game. I'll, I'll give them that. They level Jessica out pretty well. 